Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am, and today we are going to continue on exploring... I don't know what this place is called. I think Melv? I think it's called Melf. I'll go and open the chest. Uh, there's a chest. Cool. You got a wake stone chart. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> Would you mind coming over here? Why? Are you rushing me? Oh, have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. Oh, no, I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My family runs a little shop in Vernworth. So when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found in this village, I thought I'd come and fetch some for us. Made the job. But, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the medicine. Sorry, I did not mean to skip that dialogue there. It will be a shame to return empty handed after coming all this way. But what more can I do? I'll help you. What? You'd do that? You'd get the medicine for me? I suppose there's no harm in that. If you're really sure... Oh, sir, I'd be most grateful. Seems my luck's not as rotten as I thought. I'll wait right here for your return, sir. And many thanks for your kindness. You can combine two materials to create a new item. When combining, you can either choose the materials individually or select a combination that you have previously tried. You can also prioritize the inventory you want materials to be taken from, from first, the risens or their pawns. Awesome. We could make the fruit robberant ourselves, or simply purchase some at Rune's Apothecary here in Melv. Um, yes, of course. I see it now. Can we make it? Hmm. Ah, well met. Here for some fruit, Roberant, are we? I don't know. How much is it? Ooh, 600 gold? Do come again. No How do we combine stuff? Um, I don't even think we could make it. Day All right. Today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. Ah, well met. Here for some fruit, Rober and Top. Yeah, I guess so. Just one. We do come again. We ought to bring this to the one expecting it. All right, let's talk to that little girl. I got your medicine. Get out of the way, Lucy. Hmm. Hello again, sir. Say, have you brought some fruit robberant for me? Sure did. Oh, so this is what it looks like. Brilliant. Many thanks, sir. I haven't much to offer in return. I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. He'll want to reward you proper like, I'll bet. It was a pleasure to recount such good tidings. Awesome. Level 5. I wanted to explore in here before the one lady was like, follow me. Over here, if you please. No. 
I think that's where the main quest is. Some guy we gotta talk to or something. At least that's what um, the one soldier said. There's some dude in a tavern we need to talk to. I read the quest uh, before starting the video because it was a little hazy on what we had to do. One can see far to the distance from here. It would be a good place to take stock of our surroundings. Fluted bow. I quite agree. How good is the fluted bow? Any better? Uh, no. Worse. So we can sell that. Maybe, uh, get some caps back. Is this it? <gasps> oh, that, that was scary. <laughs> Look at that over there, though. There's a lot to this world. And I cannot wait to explore it all. This is a powerful weapon. A single bolt loosed from it would carry tremendous lethal force. It is not how we use this, but when that counts. I imagine it would be most beneficial in combat. Can, can we go down the ladder? You're doing circles, homie. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? I'll pick that up. We might have need of it. Ooh. I did not want to fall to my death while exploring the first area. Well, technically it's not the first area. We did uh, start in that encampment. Just want to search these houses real fast, see if there's any stuff to collect. Got a little bit of... Or a little bit over half of our gold back from buying the fruit roberant. To live on a performer's wage. Um, that looks like the way out. Don't want to get out of town. I just want to explore the town a little bit. I'll try not to explore too much, especially if we're like in a big, big town. I'll try to keep my exploration to a minimum and do that uh, when I'm not... What the hell? Give me, give me the items. Give me the items. Following along, I trust. Take care not to lose sight of me. Sure, lady. Damn. Just... Looting everything before I even get a chance, huh? We'll probably sell the majority of this kind of stuff until we actually start getting into the game. We just need some money. Definitely not digging the hat. The hat looks goofy here, as hell. Goofy as hell. Yet if to befall him, I, I couldn't live with myself. Okay, we we've made back plenty of money. Is there anything behind here? To have returned by now. We're here, Master. Oh, we're here? Yeah, you keep telling me. Uh, let's go in here. Oh, my God. 
This is generally used as a material. So not I'm gonna. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Awesome. So I'm not gonna Shall lie. Shall we go speak with Sir Leonard, Master? Hi. Uh, is there something to calm the pawns down from their talking? God, every time I'm like trying to talk, they're just like saying something to interrupt me. I didn't even know what I was you gonna think say. I know where to find the person you're looking for. Yes, okay, I got the it. Guide is most welcome. Well, Matt, you're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? She told me all about it. It was a very brave thing you did. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, consider this a small token of my gratitude. Now, tell me, are you registered with a guild? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training, which comes in very useful when pursuing a vacation. Well, now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Um, what are the fighters? It is a vacation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. Fighters favor a balanced approach, excelling in both offense and defense, and can adapt to any situation. I am a fighter myself, and should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, I might be willing to impart unto you some of what I know. Um, well, I'm currently an archer, but why don't you explain a little more in detail of what an archer does? Naturally, it is a vocation for those who seek to master the bow, an exceptionally useful long-ranged weapon. At close range, however, a bow is nary more useful than a walking stick. Aye, the secret to being a successful archer is maintaining distance between you and your foes. And of mages? It is a vocation for those who seek to master the mystical arts. Magic. Mages can cast a wide array of offensive spells and aid their allies with magical support. However, the more powerful the spell, the longer one must spend in counting it. Thus, a mage is unlikely to last long on the field of battle without allies to protect them. Tell me about the thieves. That seems like an interesting vocation. It is a vocation for those who seek to master the dagger. Such blades lack heft, though this grants them the advantage of speed. Thieves favor light armor, which leaves them more vulnerable to attacks than those of other vocations. Their talents depend upon their finesse and ability to compensate for the length of their blades through sheer agility. Are there any other vocations I should know about? Should you dedicate yourself to a vocation, you will find that new paths to master will open up to you over time. Try them as you like. Okay, well, thank you for your time and explaining all the vocations to me. Very well. There is no wrong choice in any case. It is entirely up to you which vocation you adopt. But I shan't take up any more of your time. Pray be well. The master's teachings. The master's teaching is the most powerful skill that can be acquired by each vocation. Learning a master's teaching requires the use of a special tome, which you can receive if you impress the vocation master with your abilities. However, the true potential of this skill can only be realized by those who 
by those whose vocation rank is high enough. Here at the inn, we also offer changes of vocation for those who seek it. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? Um, yeah, let's organize our storage real quick. Let's put that away. Put that away. That, that, that. Oh, I need to equip that. We'll give these books to Lucy. I bet she, she can use these a little better than me. Um, what do you got to say? Anything interesting you've heard lately? Tis good to be busy. Work begets opportunity. Okay, awesome. Beautiful dialogue. You can change our vocations. All manners of vocational procedures can be carried out in the guild hall of a vocation guild. Changing vocation... If you have unlocked a vocation, you can change it or change to it at any time. Unlocking new vocations requires discipline, which is uh, acquired when defeating enemies and completing quests. Okay, it's just talking about skills and augments. Pretty normal stuff. Sweeping shots. Oh, that looks cool. Dire arrow. Nice. Keen shots. Exploding shot. That might be good to have. So why don't we do... Uh, let's do a... That first exploding shot, and then next we'll do a uh, keen, keen sight. I was about to say keen shot, but leaping punt. Oh, that's cool. Nice. All right, let's see Lucy's, Lucy's staying a mage. Um, ooh, lightning, that's good for her. We'll equip that. What does that do? Oh, uh, that might not be bad, but I think we should go with at least fire boon first because that's going to enchant a weapon with fire. We'll put it down here. What are your core skills? Focus bolt. Oh, okay. We need to get quick spells next. Quick spells and focus bolt. And that. So we need to make about 650 discipline points. Always a pleasure. Dude, you just met me. Okay. So this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. 
Let us speak with everyone we can think of who might know aught of use. Is that lady Gregor gonna wishes move? To speak with you, master. Shall we go to him? Allow me to guide you, master. I know the person you're looking for. Sure. We're in your hands, sir. Much obliged. And the camera seems very close. Is there a way to zoom that out? It's making me a little bit like not nauseous, but. Like I, it's too close. Ah, camera distance. Cool. Let's see if that helped any. Yeah, a little bit. Just when I'm running, I'm like right Here in my are. face. Ah, you've returned. Good timing too. I have questions for you. First and foremost, will you accompany me to the capital? My thanks. Are you ready to depart, or do you need some time to prepare? Um, I need some time. Very well. Speak with me once you've finished your preparations. I want to see if there's anybody to help first in town before we leave. Hell, if you've a moment to spare, I'd like a word. Well, that was very... Uh, abrupt. As you can see, we're rebuilding. A task that can always benefit from another pair of hands. What say you? Would you be willing to help? Sure, why not? Excellent. You're a good sort. I'll not soon forget this. Here's what I need from you. A bask of Saurians has made their nest outside the village. Though they're yet to cause any harm, their proximity makes the villagers uneasy. I'd like to enlist your aid in driving them away. I've prepared some explosive casks and left them by the village entrance. Use them to send the Saurians scattering. Saurians are monsters of fearsome strength, it is true. But I've yet to meet a foe that explosive casks can't scatter. Awesome. You have my support. I think it's right out here. Uh, perhaps this will seem of little consequence, but some masters rearrange their party at the drop of a hat. Ooh. One such arisen dismissed me after only half a day of service. Fascinating. <laughs> uh, I love that. That's awesome. That was awesome. Seems like they're giving you quite a few tutorials um, in the beginning. I like that compared to the first Dragon's Dogma. Well, that appears to have sent some of the beasts reeling at least. To finish the job, I'd have you drop a jar of poison into their nest. With any luck, the Saurians will realize that they chose a perilous spot and steer clear of the village boundary in future. But pray, take care not to drop it in the river. The villagers use that water on a daily basis. You must make sure your aim is true. Are we clear? Good. You'll find the jars of poison just outside the village. Toss one into the Saurian's nest, and your task is done. Now we are to throw a jar of poison. Be sure to handle it with care, Master. I will. No, oh, no, pick it up. But didn't we destroy their nest already? I mean, I don't see any eggs. Um, let's go over there. It's kind of hard to... Oh, I can run with it. Awesome. 
Wasn't sure if I'd be able to run with it or not. That guy is super tired. Am I, I the first to notice we've all got different vocations? Our respective abilities are unique as well. I see it as a glad thing. We are well poised to supplement each other's strengths. That's right, Rhea. You tell them. Here? Expertly thrown, master. I'd wager those Saurians will think twice about nesting here again. It was a pleasure to recount such good tidings. That's cool. As we're carrying something heavy, our stamina goes down faster. So that is good to know. Oh, he's waiting outside for us. You've done as I asked, I see. Many thanks for your efforts. And I must say, you've a fine arm. I couldn't have done better myself. Watching you got me thinking. It may hap you've the sense to inherit the skills I possess. <laughs> or perhaps it is a little early for such talk. In any event, thanks to the work you've done for us today, the rebuilding efforts ought to proceed apace. And for that, I'm grateful. A moment long awaited. I knew that was certainly worthwhile. A laudable result. Just what I would expect of the Arisen. It is vital that we rest and regain our strength before moving on. Uh, let's sell some stuff. I've a selection of wares that's sure to please. Do you now? Scrag a beast. I don't want to get rid of that. Wake powder, eh. Let's sell that. And then we need to equip this and give these spell books to Lucy. Pleasure doing business with you. Not. Give to Lucy. No. Buying. No. That's just as well. Make haste then. We must leave a knock. <sighs> I need time. Very well. Speak with me once you've finished your. What the hell? You have no right. I didn't mean to. Sorry. God. <laughs> Trying to be too quick and you know. Shoot. Shit like that happens. <laughs> May do be like, all right, we need to get out of here quickly. You're casting spells Master, that's trying to my kill heart me. Knows no greater peace than when I'm by your side. Well, thank you, Lucy. I don't really hear anybody chatting and saying that they need help. Forgive See, me, but I cannot guide you from here. Um, somehow my feet and I can't carry on the words you've had to put on the table. Do? He really ought to have returned by now. Is that you, Norbert? Ah, oh, fie. I got my hopes up for naught. Wait, listen. Would you be willing to search for my brother? The brave fool said he was going to look for herbs and went off into the forest. I've seen no sign of him since. I'd go and search for him myself, only, only, it is a dangerous place. Understand? I, I, I'm not afraid of monsters, but it would hardly help anything if I were to run in there unprepared and get myself hurt now, would it? So I thought, mayhap, you'd go in my place. You look like you could manage those woods better than I. Please, sir, I worry for my brother. Sure. I'll help you out. Many thanks. Right. As for where I think he's gone, go into the forest. 
and turn when you reach the tree with the bird's nest, keeping the cliff to your right. Ah, oh, this won't work, will it? I could see the root in my mind's eye, but my feet know it better than I do. I don't think I could plot it on a map, and it's hard to describe, but my brother and I are the only ones who use that path, to my knowledge. I suppose there's only one thing for it. I'll have to show you the way. Just be alert. The monsters of the forest have changed since the dragon's attack. I'll need you to watch over me, keep me safe. You will, won't you? Right. In we go, then. My life's in your hands, friend. We've been called upon to render aid. Let us make haste. Is that where you... Okay, I was like, where'd he go? Thought I heard somebody earlier saying, where did he go? He should have been back by now or some shit. It's kind of why I went back. I wasn't expecting the other guy to talk to me though. Make haste then. We must leave anon. Holy fuck moly, no. Very well. Speak. I'm trying to do something. Calm down, guy. Can we make him run faster? We can. Just not that much faster. A fine place to harvest some ingredients. No harm in picking a few. Seems not ever goes right. Ooh, beefsteak. Damn, how far did your brother go, man? Ah, uh, I'll take that. We might find a use for it. Oh, I actually need explosives to do exploding shot. This is a good spot. Let's stop here a moment. I've camped here with my brother many a time. No doubt he caught his breath here before moving on, same as us. It is about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, master? Camping. If the Arisen has a camping kit to hand, they can pitch their tent by the remains of a campfire found at set spots throughout the wilderness. Much like staying at an inn town, um, at an inn in town, resting at a campsite restores the party's health and stamina and recovers the loss gauge. Adventurers who seldom return to town should be sure to keep a camping kit in their packs, least exhaustion overwhelm them. Camp also affords the opportunity to grill meats. Oh, okay. Granting a boost to certain stats upon consumption. The finer the quality of meat, the greater the increase you can expect. Before setting up camp, it would be prudent to eliminate any foes lurking nearby. Neglecting to do so only heightens the chances of an ambush while your party is at its most vulnerable. Good to know. Now we'll be alright not to camp. Unless so we have to. If we have to, then sure, but if we don't have to, then I'm not going to. Oh, look at that. We got a camping kit. Oh, that's fucking heavy. Keep that in mind. Camping kits, kits are heavy. I would have preferred not to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. 
We must not let down our guard. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait right there. Damn, that guy's got a tiny head. <laughs> Uh, I don't mean to laugh, but holy moly, that his head is super tiny. So, yeah, we're going to need a... God, you're slow, bud. Where the hell did your brother go, man? Can anyone hear me? Please! I need help! Clearly. There's a ton of wolves over there. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. My magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. You'll get what's coming to you. Is there any more? Master. I... I thought I was done for. Ah, oh, it was a near thing. How are you feeling? I think I'll be all right. But if you hadn't come for me, I... Thanks, Ian. Save your thanks, Norbert. I'm your brother. And I ought have come sooner. From where I'm standing, all that matters is that you made it in time. Anyway, I'm eager to be rid of this place. Let's return to the village, shall we? The sooner the better. I've got to deliver these medicinal herbs to the people who need them. Ah, you'll hear no complaints from me. Let's be... Let us take every precaution that we might see our charge delivered safely. Ah, uh, escort quests. My favorite. Ooh, look at that up there. Can we get up there? I bet we can. We'll just have to come back for that. I want to come back and explore over here. There's, it looks like there's quite a bit to explore. I was looking at the map. Obviously, this is the edge, um, which pretty big map. Look at all of this. It just, it's pretty big. In terms of Dragon's Dogma, that is. I want to come back up here and explore before we continue the main quest. Or maybe we'll continue the main quest and then we'll come back over here and explore. I don't know. We'll see. I like that this dude's name is Ifen. If anybody has ever played Divinity, the original Sin 2, you'll know who Ifen is. I wonder if that is why they named him that. 
Where is this? Looks like a mining spot. Is it up here? No, the let's not mess with that. Not why we have people following us. You wish me to return at once, master. Come on, guys. Maybe I'll uh, explore off screen when it comes to stuff like this because I feel like it will take up a ton of time if not. Um, and it's probably just grabbing loot. If there's a side quest or something like that, I'll be sure to um, save it. If that's like something that we run into while I'm exploring is what I mean. See, I see these outcroppings. Ooh. We have found a material. The different combinations of materials result in different creations. Back at last. That was an ordeal. I I'm exhausted, but I can rest after I've delivered these herbs. I'll be back soon. Good on you. Just take care, all right? You wonder why I don't follow him? So long as he stays away from that forest, we'll be fine on his own. When my brother told me he was going to fetch those herbs, I refused to join him. Said it was too dangerous. What with the monsters acting strangely of late. And I was right. I may have none of this would have happened had I only gone with him. My brother is always the one taking the initiative, while I stand around with my hands in my pockets. But today's misadventure showed me that the path forward is the one with fewer regrets, even when you can't be sure where it leads. We managed to save Norbert, and perhaps that's all that matters. Still, I can't help but wonder if I couldn't have spared him some of the pain and fear he suffered, if I'd only steeled myself sooner. So from now on, I'm going to trust in my own instincts. Never again will I let fear stop me from doing what I know to be right. With Sir Norbert safely returned, Mel shan't lack for medicinal herbs. Two good deeds in one, you might say. Homespun. What was that? Homespun. It doesn't look too bad. Looks all right. Can we give this to somebody? Oh, that'll make Lucy heavy. We'll give it to Ifen. Sir Gregor wishes to speak with you, Master. Shall we go to him? Sure. Methinks so I know where to find the. Make haste, then. We must leave anon. Uh, sure. I'm ready. Good. Then let us be on our way. I don't want to waste too much time and it's already starting to get dark at least that's what it looks like freshly rested as we are this battle ought to be in our favor try not to get hit lest all that vim go to waste Definitely loving the archer vocation. Let my magics grant you an elemental boon.
Whoa. Your magical aid has dissipated. Pray cast it anew. Hell yeah. And I got another level? Jeez, they're just fucking tossing out levels like candy, aren't they? It'll probably slow down soon. I'll gather this. It might be of use. It might be. I can't get up there. Come on now. Oh, uh, that's really pretty. Might take a screenshot of that later. Is that the encampment that we started at over there? I think so. Kind of want to go back to that encampment, see if there's anything else to do over there. The Arisen is the lawful ruler of Vermond. So it has always been. To claim the title is to claim the throne. Yet, not all claims are true. Our kingdom sees many pretenders, and they are not dealt with like you. Best hope you're not one of them. Regardless, you can do well not to invite my mistrust on our journey. Where did that other harpy go? Did she fall Stay with me, up top over there? Wait right there. Fire's blade. That was easy. Oh, vocation went up again. Cool. And that was a lot of money. Some more money. We're definitely get quite a bit uh, we're definitely getting quite a bit of money I'm gonna turn my lantern on it's starting to get dark where did the guy go did he run off no his soldiers are over there him and his soldiers guess I should pay attention to the map a little more that might make things a little easier Hold here a moment. I shall bid them open the gate. Who's that you've brought with you, Watchhead, sir? An Arisen, by all appearances. An Arisen? Another pretender, you mean? I see the Sovereign's ascension has done little to stop such charlatans from plying their trade. It is uncertain. This one commands the loyalty of the pawns. What? Impossible. You know as well as I do that there can be but one arisen, and he's up in the palace. I'm well aware of how preposterous the idea is, thank you. However, as I do not believe it my place to rule on such a matter, I would make my report to the capital. If the claim is false, we will be rewarded handsomely for our trouble. If the claim is true, however, who can say? All's been arranged. Come, let us pass through the gate. I want to check over here first. Looks like these guys are building a bridge. <laughs> Just randomly taking some stuff, huh? Thanks, Lucy. Thank you, Lucy. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. Not sure I want to travel at night. Is there a place An to rest? An ox cart was meant to meet us, yet it is nowhere in sight. 
ought may have befallen it. Best we press on. Um, is there a place to rest? Passage of time, time is an ever-flowing river in this world, and the activities and behaviors of its inhabitants reflect this. People are unlikely to remain in the same place all day long and may only appear in the morning, at night, or at midday. To pass the time, you can either stay at an inn or make use of one of these special seats found outdoors in set locations. Come nightfall, you will be able to see no further than the ground at your feet, and the onset of darkness summons fearsome monster monsters not seen by day. Explore the wilderness after sunset at your own peril, and be sure you have a lantern in your pack. Some items that can be gathered will change over time, such as by ripening and growing more flavorful. There are also items that, if allowed to age just long enough, will become more useful when combined material, or combining materials. However, you should keep a close eye on raw items in particular, as consuming anything that has been aged past its prime is... Uh, is likely to have unpleasant side effects. Certain objects and structures that can be destroyed by your attacks will regenerate after a set amount of time uh, Time has passed. Similarly, fruits, berries, and other gatherable flora will grow back after a time. Okay, that was a lot. Uh, sorry if I'm reading absolutely everything. Um, I'll try to calm down a little bit on it because I do know quite a bit on Dragon's Dogma in general. So a lot of this stuff I already know, but they also have some new mechanics in the game. So is there a place to rest? I know we just talked about benches. Pray, allow me to open your chest. You just opened it. Is there another one? Oh, I guess there was another one. Oh, just waterfall. yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we see if there's all to be found while we're here? There's a campsite. Maybe we should uh, set up camp. Make camp. Sure. How do we cook? Right here? Oh, wow. That looks really good. Is that a real image? Did they really record a real image I'm of that? I'm all for swapping stories, but perhaps another night. I can scarce keep my eyes open. Good sleep is the key to a good adventure. I would like to would cook that again. Such tranquility could last. Right, you are. Uh, I just want to. Our master is a changeable sort. I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. In battle, I shall follow your lead and prioritize support. Good evening, Arisen. Okay, that's it. <laughs> Good. Let us make for the capital. Okay, I guess we can't cook anymore. We can only do it once. Um, rest until morning. Our adventure continues. Come, we've much to be getting on with. 
Um, items. We'll give this to Ifen or Ifen. Ready to forge on? Ooh, I didn't notice this earlier. See, it's good that we uh, waited until day or rested until morning. Forgotten rift stones. Okay. I'll read a lot of that stuff off uh, screen when I'm not recording just to save some time. I want to get over there though. Oh, no, 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 no. Ugh. Hey, is this fishing? It is. Oh, I'm not nice. Quite as nimble as I'd like to be. But I suppose that's what I get for carrying so many things. Uh, I don't think that was the way to get to it, but... Oh, cool, we got a wake stone. Hmm. Oh, another wake stone. Awesome. That is... The worst case scenario there. <laughs> Hopefully it sends me to the other side. Nope. Okay, how are we getting back over here, everybody? Oh, what? Don't tell me we're stuck. Okay. Don't know why she just fell from the sky. I'm saved. Thank you, Arisen. What is going on? Why are you guys falling from the sky? Alright. I'm going to get across real quick. I'll see everybody in just a second. Alright. I made it across. Finally. A <laughs> uh, little hardcore parkour. Don't know where Lucy went. There she is. Come on. This video might be a little longer. Whoa. Is everyone all right? More marks of the dragon's fury. Its rampage must have weakened the earth here. I guess so. Looks like some goblins over here. I would have preferred Ow. not to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. We must not let down our guard. Avoid flame at any cost arisen. You have been doused in oil. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. I think that's every buddy we killed. Well, I say buddy, it's goblins. Every goblin. Oh, nope. You Ow. have my protection. Ow. I have your protection because I'm on fire. Whatever it is you need, I shall gladly oblige. Uh, to not be on fire? <laughs> That's what I really need. Got an apple. I 
Shall I say it? We trounced our foe, well and true. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. I dare say the cart shan't be traversing this. Onward! It might await us on the road ahead. Roaring flame. Where's that harpy go? There you are. Quit moving so I can hit you. Thank you. with our next attack. Ooh, a chest. Carry on, guys. I'm just going to loot this chest real quick. Yeah, this video is going to be a bit longer. I apologize, but we kind of... I'll go and open the chest. What chest? What are you talking about? Okay, whatever. Got a chest. <laughs> Thanks. Another camping spot. I pray my efforts aid your cause. Okay. Didn't even talk to you. Why are you trying to get me to recruit you? I see you cannot manage without me for a moment, Arisen. What's this? We're trapped. Oh, is this the... I remember seeing this on a trailer or like an overview of the Fine. gameplay. A cyclops! To think we'd encounter one here of all places. Um I think there's an explosive cyclops. barrel around here or something Brave, that we can throw. Guard. Right Look here. Water is seeping through the cracks. Where you not get swept into the current. That's awesome. That's so freaking awesome. I love that. Strike hard enough, and we might not have to do this twice. Strike fast and true, and our quarry shall fall. Understood. Let my magics grant you an elemental boon. Jesus, dude is getting messed up over there. Kind of seen that coming. I was just standing there as he was running at me. Yeah, I kind of got squished. Um, I'm getting stepped on, guys. I really need to get up. I could use some help. It seems we have enraged our foe. Might we not use their rage to our advantage? Diomi. Awesome. Time we made for the capital. 
inform the people of Vermont of your... You have my gratitude, sir. It would seem I misjudged you. I had taken you for another false arisen. Goodness knows we see a lot of them. Yet the value you showed in coming to our aid has dispelled such thoughts. Here, take this as a mark of my trust. Give it to one of the Sentinels stationed at the gates to the capital, and you'll be granted an audience with Captain Brandt. You're free to make your own way to the capital now. I see no need to keep you under constant watch, and I'm sure you'll breathe a little easier as well, I. Of course, if you'd rather continue to accompany us, you are still welcome to join us on the Oxcart. Tis your decision. Um, no, I don't think I'm going to continue uh, traveling with them because I want to go back to the encampment. This is generally used as a material. Um, back... I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Okay, can I talk, pawns, please? <laughs> Jesus. That, that's something that's kind of uh, annoying. I will be looking to see if I can't turn the... Uh, pawns down like how much they're talking or whatnot hopefully we can um, I don't want to turn them off but I do want to turn it down all right so the video did run a little long I apologize for that but I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video hopefully you all enjoyed it if you did go ahead and hit that thumbs up button if you didn't hit the thumbs down button, let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.